This is Sam Junctional Tourniquet by Sam Medical. SJT, as it's also known, is made up of five components. A ruggedized belt that leverages patented SAM auto-stop buckle technology, an inflatable target compression device, or TCD, a second TCD with an attached extender, a hand pump to inflate the TCDs, and an auxiliary strap to control junctional bleeds of the upper extremity. In a training scenario, do not inflate to full occlusion on simulated patient. The SJT is used to control hemorrhage in the upper arm or axilla when an ordinary tourniquet cannot be used. Before applying SJT, your patient must first be exposed to the extent that is appropriate for the given situation. Because the subclavian artery lies deep, a special TCD extender is used to contact and apply pressure to the subclavian artery as it exits from beneath the clavicle. Apply SJT around the patient's chest and as high as possible under their arms. Connect the belt using the Fastex buckle. Then pull the brown handles away from each other until you hear and feel the click of the auto stop buckle. Ensure that the plastic D-ring is on the injured side of the patient, aligning with the side of their neck. While maintaining tension, immediately press the precision strap down onto the Velcro surface of the SJT to secure it in place. Don't be concerned if you hear a second click after the precision strap is secured. The correct force will be maintained. Next, locate the auxiliary strap, TCD, TCD extender, and hand pump. Attach the auxiliary strap to the D-ring on the belt. Place the TCD on the strap, centered on the light brown Velcro. The tube and hand pump should extend out laterally. Connect the larger plastic clip of the auxiliary strap to the D-ring on the front of the belt. Then, place the auxiliary strap over the patient's shoulder, positioning the Velcro toward the patient. Reach behind your patient and attach the metal clip to the paracord on the back of the belt, as close as possible to your patient's midline. Ensure that the paracord is fully seated within the snap hook and not the body of the belt or your patient's clothing. Position the extender on the TCD just below the clavicle and directly adjacent to the shoulder. With the palm of your hand, apply extremely firm downward pressure on the TCD to ensure that the extender is well seated below the clavicle. Tighten the strap using the brown handle to remove any slack. With the TCD centered under the auxiliary strap, inflate it using the hand pump to apply direct pressure under the clavicle until hemorrhage is controlled. Remove only at a definitive care facility. Unlike the locking True Force buckle found on the new SAM XT extremity tourniquet, SAM Auto Stop buckle does not lock allowing you to quickly reposition the SJT for proper alignment if necessary. Learn more about SAM Junctional Tourniquet at sammedical.com.